The Soybean School on realagriculture.com is brought to you by Pride Seeds, High Stick NT, and Cruiser Max Vibrance Beans. Hey, Dan Foster, market development agronomist for Pride Seeds, coming to you today from Canada's Outdoor Farm Show. Uh, beautiful weather here. What I wanted to talk to you today about is soybean green stem syndrome. It's becoming a bit of an issue in some areas where we were really, really dry during flowering season on the soybeans. So what is green stem syndrome in soybeans? It's when we have full senescence on the beans, almost full leaf drop or full leaf drop, and yet we still have a solid green stem. So those soybeans are ripe, ready to combine, but we're stuck with a green stem. Now, why is that a big issue? Well, it really affects combinability. And in an IP soybean situation, you can end up with some staining. So what causes this syndrome in soybeans? Well, what happens is when we're super dry or under a stress, soybeans start to get rid of flowers, abort those flowers. Well, if we start aborting flowers at nodes, and that soybean plant still moving nutrients up and down that plant, it has nowhere to shove those nutrients out into creating a seed. And then what happens is all those sugars and nutrients get stuck inside the stem and it won't dry down because they have nowhere to go. Here you can see we've got no leaves to get rid of anything and we've got nothing else to make that soybean really die down to make combinability easy. You can also end up having a ripened plant with some green foliage still left on it. So what do we do in these situations? Well, if you're in a IP situation, you can use a glyphosate for a burn down and the sooner the better once you're at the right stage for that, get rid of that green foliage that's stuck on there and that will help that plant dry down and make combinability and uh, your quality much better. Now what do we do in a glyphosate tolerant situation? Well, so you got a soybean, a Roundup Ready soybean, how do we clean them up? Well couple products that are going to be good for that situation. One that I'd really recommend and that I like is Aragon. Uh, perfect burn down. Make sure you talk to your chemical retailer on timing. And some of the other things, Gramoxone, Liberty. But I really strongly feel Aragon is probably going to be your best situation, which will also clean up maybe some of those uh, hard to kill glyphosate tolerant weeds if you had them in your field as well. So remember, green stem syndrome in soybeans caused by aborted flowers, Nowhere for those nutrients and sugars to go within the plant. Plant end up staying that green. Real trouble to combine, hard to thrash. Beans are ready. What do we do, right? So we make sure we get in there, do that pre-harvest burn down, whether it's Aragon or glyphosate, gonna make your uh, harvest go much smoother and really clean that up.